Hi everyone, my name is Sarah and a friend of mine told me that you might be interested in learning a little bit about backyard container gardening. Uh, container gardening is really fun and the best part about it is you don't need a lot of space. If you have a little patio or a porch or any kind of little outdoor space that can fit a pot, you are good to go. So um, there are three main things to consider first that plants need, and that is soil, light, and water. So before you go out and buy, you might wanna do a little bit of research online uh, if you wanna grow a particular plant, what that plant needs. Some like indirect light, some like a lot of sun, uh, some don't like to be watered a lot, um, and, and kind of adapting to this and getting to know the plant is part of the fun. So um, a, a little bit of research first goes a long way. When you are ready to plant, uh, you don't need a lot to get started. So you have your plant, you have your pot. I like pots with a lot of drainage holes on the bottom because it helps prevent root rot little garden spade and some potting soil. So when I went out, I knew that I was looking to start growing some peppers this year. Um, this is a little baby uh, cayenne pepper. So I'll be able to use for making salsas and sauces. And you know, I just like adding a little bit of spice to my food anyway. So um, here's some general organic potting mix. There's a lot of drainage in this. You see those little white bits in there that helps promote drainage. And my shovel. So all we need to do, and you don't need gloves. I just wear gloves because I get dirt everywhere. I'm not, not a very neat gardener. All we need to do to start is put a little bit of the soil in the pot because you don't want to put the plant right down there. It needs a little bit of space for its roots to go. So I put a couple of inches down here, I think. So you can see. And then take this out, give this a little squeeze and then slowly work the plant out and see how all of its roots are wrapped around uh, its container here. It's been growing in here for a long time. So in order to encourage them to grow out a little, maybe just give this a little squeeze, loosen that up a little bit. And then Place it in your container. And then you fill around it with the rest of your soil. Making a mess. Making sure that it's evenly filled in on all sides of the plant. You can pack it down a little bit, but don't press too hard. It does need some oxygen around the roots so that they've got some uh, ease in growing. And here I have a newly potted pepper plant. Uh, I know that this plant needs about six hours of sun, so I'm going to place it in a nice sunny spot in my backyard and uh, make sure that I'm coming out every couple of days to make sure um, that it doesn't need water or it doesn't have any little little buggies affecting it or anything. And um, in about eight weeks or so, I should start to have some really delicious red peppers to add to uh, recipes. 
So um, that's it. That is all you need to get started. It's extremely fun and very addicting. You know, a lot of people start out with uh, just one plant in their backyard or their front yard, and then you know suddenly you have a little a little garden or a little farm growing in a couple of months. So uh, I hope this has been fun and helpful. And uh, if you have any questions, please uh, feel free to uh, reach out to the foundation and I'd be happy to make a follow-up video. All right, thank you very much, everyone. Have a great day and happy gardening.